The woman was about to die of thirst, but instead of drinking the half bottle of water in her hand, she raised it to the top of her head and poured it all over her face. Then she stuck to the steel plate to suck up the water droplets, but this little water was too little to have any effect. She had been drifting at sea alone for seven days and seven nights. Lucy's body had reached its limit, and she could no longer hold on. She slumped to the ground and gradually lost consciousness. Just then, suddenly water droplets dripped onto her face. Along with the ticking sound, Lucy slowly opened her eyes. In a daze, she saw raindrops dripping down from the gap. She quickly opened her mouth and greedily enjoyed the sweet rain. Then she didn't dare to rest and quickly found all the boxes to store this hard to get rainwater, even the last can for canned food. She also wanted to fill it with rainwater, but just as she was about to open the lid, the pull ring was accidentally broken. However, this move gave Lucy an inspiration. She first comforted her daughter, then took out the rope and stood on the wooden box again, then put the rope around the sawn steel plate, and then tightly grasped the rope. She wanted to pry open the steel plate like opening a can. After everything was ready, she began to pull down hard, watching the gap getting wider and wider. Lucy didn't dare to stop for a moment. 